Welcome back to new demo from Ignib. Today we will present to you a quick demo uh, is new system, B2B system. If you enter, you can see you are in the default dashboard, like, share, can increase your dash B2B custom dashboard from here. Manage dashboard and create. I create my simple dashboard, commerce B2B dashboard, add widget, add star, add widget in your. Okay, it's simple. What uh, what new inside customer? You have here a lot of uh, of uh, feature for for B2B. I can't contact customer, customer group, customer user, and customer user all. Okay, let's go to home page. If you enter with admin, you can go to dashboard. If you enter to web or when your server inside all the way, you can see the front end. I will go and I need from here create new okay so uh, I will create a new tool uh, order paid order okay I will enter it now okay if I try to enter the system can be my account is not confirmed I can go back to my email to confirm or directly the owner or the seller the be seller inside my marketplace can go to customer user and search for other side or other customer one just you have there a confirm if you say confirm confirm now you can cancel the customer or send confirmation email now you will be to icon green and green icon okay just I will try for a second time Now I will enter back credential by report. Just program password. Okay, this is my custom view as customer user. If you go to account, you can see. An account for this. And for this new company, you can see all customer user of this company. I have one, or of this account. I have here lots of account I can merge this account with one account for same company okay merge it merged Okay, this company have two customers. This company may have three. No, no. Customer email have three customers. Every customer has customers users. You can add more than one. Okay, you can see 
I should be list under and cut of this. If you go to contact, this is normal every every I have one here. Can create one without problem. Okay, customer you can see the three company and you have here customer user. That may be complex, but uh, for organize uh, the B2B e commerce, you need an account, have three custom customers' users or three customers, and all customers have a customer's users. We can we can have more than one customer's users. Okay, if I enter to my home page, I have here a core feature inside our CRM. I can enter to this. Add ship list. Okay, as I will, I was add this to my ship list. I can. Add new shopping list. Shopping list two, read and add. I have here two shopping list. Okay, I can start my checkout or request code from any one of this shopping list. Here I can create order or request a code. Okay. Uh, if I request cut from here, I can. I want for for dollar. I have company name to email address of your customer users. Okay, uh, where or how you want ship this? What's the type of shipment or this? The owner or dealer or any other can go to account and create. Cat of his name and enter directly to your email to and say to request Scott. You can go to request Scott if after study. Okay, I will go here. You can, if you go to workflow, you can see or change. Life cycle of send request send cut I can't no it's not here but you see offer I can have create order I I can price of this for four dollar as I want my customer and save I can add billion others and shipping others the order is great for this customer from court okay if this customer go to order a history you can see and you order for four dollars. This uh, nice for B two B. You can start shipping tracking at the track number method three. Keep 
Okay. Alright. And save. A quick uh, view about your comments. We will continue in other video for more explain this new B2B system. Thanks for watching.